Hey, what's up guys? Ivor 94 back with another action figure review and today we are looking at some more G.I. Joe 6 inch classified series by Hasbro and it is Roadblock coming in the blue box and he is number one. There's the side and then here is the other side. Nice little artwork there and then on the back side we get that poster picture once again. So let's check out Roadblock. He seems to be the biggest figure yet in the line that I've reviewed in the order that I'm going. And he comes with the biggest gun, that's for sure. So we get a gun, we get a knife, and a magazine. So very uh, low on accessories this wave is, just because they don't come with heads and hands, apparently, so far. Uh, but here is the gun he comes with, and there it is. It's a gray gun with some paint applications on it, which I do like that. So good job there. We've got some red and blue. Makes all the difference. Imagine if this thing was all gray. It would be stupid, right? I mean, I'm holding it wrong. There it is. It's supposed to be this way, I think. So there it is. We've got some translucent plastic on the end of it as well. So that's cool. Very nice. And then here is that magazine that it comes with. Detachable. Taking a page out of Mesco's book there. And that just fits right in here. So, pretty cool. And then last but not least, we get a knife here, which is a different sculpt than the one Scarlet head, so it's not the same there. And this is just all silver. Here's our roadblock. Here's the head sculpt. Here's the back. So the torso, nicely painted. Something they're doing throughout the whole wave is giving it some nice paint apps. So, it's no... No difference here, so nicely done. Got a tattoo of a line, which is actually nicely done. Let's get it in focus. I'm kind of impressed because it got cut off because they had to separate the joints and it still looks just fine. Like it looks like it's like perfect. So nicely done on that tattoo. And then going down to the legs, you can see the texture there on the pants. Down to the boots here, and then there's the hand, and then the back side. So there's your closer look at Roadblock. Well, now we're going to take a look at the articulation of Roadblock, and the head sits on a bar jointed hinge, so he looks up a lot, and he'll look down a lot too. Left and right, get some head toe. He does have that neck articulation that Hasbro's been implementing into this GI Joe line. We got the arms that go forward and back. In and out, we have those little sockets and butterfly joints on the shoulders. Bicep swivel, double jointed elbows, swivel at the wrist with a hinge here. Both of them have those regular hinges. And then we do get this soft um, vest. So that's going to kind of hinder his torso articulation. But he does have an app crunch down there. I can see an app crunch underneath. And it doesn't seem like you can remove this vest unless you cut it open. Uh, but if you want to shirt this roadblock, you can cut this thing open and take it off. Um, but other than that, it's going to hinder the ab crunch. You're not going to get them to crunch too much. We do get a waist swivel, a little bit of a torso tilt. We get those drop down uh, groin leg articulation. So you can drop it down and have them kick further forward and back. We get a full split on the legs. We get a thigh swivel, double jointed knees on the legs. And then we get the boot cut shin swivel ankle rocker that goes forward and back and side to side so i did manage to get him with his weapon in hand here now we're going to start our comparisons off with some other gi joes we have duke and here we have him next to destro and next up we have scarlet and here we have him next to the ghostbusters peter venkman figure from the six inch hasbro line and here's a Marvel Legends Beast figure for comparison. And the SH Figuarts Ultra Instinct Goku. And one last one, we have the Mafex Jim Lee Cyclops. All right, and that's going to wrap things up for this review of Roadblock from the G.I. Joe Classified series. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Leave a comment. Check out my other G.I. Joe reviews out so far. We have Duke, Scarlet, and Destro. And as always, subscribe if you haven't done so already. Have a great day. Bye. That's crispy.